Mares are beginning to move up in behind that Metro Home Building Center starting gate for tonight's seventh race. Now let's go back upstairs for the race call to track announcer Vance Cameron. Hurricane Hill, Avid Yankee, Cinder Angelina. HP Ruby's Joyce, Bad Silver, Kittimimic. Should have been a clown, Southern Heart outside, top of the stretch. They're approaching a start. The rough and pacing Cinder Angelina, HP Ruby's Joyce, and Hurricane Hill are firing out. Fourth into the turn, that is Avid Yankee. To get away, fifth is Bad Silver. Now in six, as they move on round the turn, it should have been a clown. Kid of Mimic, seventh, and Southern Heart is the trailer. To the back stretch they go, led by Hurricane Hill. In line to Corey McPherson. Cinder Angelina tucked away for the two-hole ride. Up into third, that's Avid Yankee. Fourth on the cones is H.P. Ruby's Joyce. Then in fifth, that is Bad Silver. Racing from six, should have been a clown. Kid of Image is seventh. Then the trailer is Southern Heart, 29. Seconds flat was the quarter. As they arrive at the three-eighths, the leader is Hurricane Hill. In the two-hole, Coming out of the turn, Cinder Angelina. Racing from third, that's Avid Yankee. H.P. Ruby's Joyce fourth. Then in fifth, it's Bad Silver. Moving up six from the outside is Kinnam Image. Should have been a clown seventh. Southern Heart on the outside, the trailer. 59 and three was the half. Midway into the paddock turn, approaching 5-8. The unchallenged leader is Hurricane Hill. Second on the cones, Cinder Angelina. Avid Yankee. Continuing third up on the outside is Kinnam Image fourth. HP Ruby's Joyce caught in at the rail fifth. Moving into six is Southern Heart. Then Bad Silver should have been a clown on the outside the trailer. They arrived at three quarters led by Hurricane Hill in one. 29 and 4. Cinder Angelina second. Kidam Image is there coming on the outside third. Avid Yankee fourth. Southern Heart fifth. And they're headed on home. Hurricane Hill the leader. Kidam Image on the outside. Cinder Angelina along the rail. Hurricane Hill doubles up McPherson. Every call's a winning one. Second is Kidam Image. Cinder Angelina third. Time for the mile was one. 58 and 1. Walker, we talked about her in the pre-race. She was dropping down. She got a better post, and really she controlled it right from the word go. And she got all the respect in here tonight on that class drop in Corey McPherson. Did a really good job with her 29 flat. Got that nice middle half breather there. 59 and three down to three quarters. 129 and four. A gutsy effort from the six. Kedem Image here first up for Dale Spence. They raced really well here as they closed home. Big for last quarter here. Time of the mile 158 and one. 28 and two in the end of it. A real nice effort from the one Hurricane Hill. The six Kedem Image race as well. Two and a nice drive by Jason Hughes with Cinder Angelina, who got the pocket trip, followed Hurricane Hill, and got the show going here. So we have a 1 6 3 triactor here in race seven at Red Shores. Hurricane Hill into the seventh race winner's circle. 
Bay Pacing Mare, the nine-year-old daughter of Cam Luck, is from the Art Major Dam Cosmo Blue Chip, owned and trained by Joe McDonald of Alvin. Corey McPherson, second winner for the double, the wire-to-wire -wire victory in 158 and one. Hurricane Hill in the seventh. This race replay on Channel 2 on your in-house monitor is brought to you by Syntrack Print and Graphic, Inc. Mention this ad and receive $20 off your first order of 500 or more full-color business cards. Syntrack, 59 Watts Avenue in the Business Park. <laughs> 